overseas tonight, a deadly earthquake rocking Taiwan. The magnitude 6.4 quake striking, buildings tilting, people trapped inside hotels tonight. Emergency responders scrambling in the dark, and ABC's Bob Woodruff tonight reporting in from the region. Tonight, destruction and chaos in the streets of Taiwan. Buildings destroyed, this apartment teetering on the verge of collapse, and authorities now searching for those trapped inside. This man bravely climbing to search for the missing. At least two are dead and at least 200 injured in the 6.4 magnitude quake. It struck just before midnight local time. Roads, bridges, cars damaged. Neighborhoods reduced to rubble. Rescuers scramble to bring survivors to safety. And in this apartment complex, children are handed down from a balcony to safety below. This was the largest in a string of 70 reported quakes in the last two days. There was a 6.1 tremor on Sunday that experts fear may trigger even more in the days and months ahead. It would be hard to tell people in Taiwan that uh, this sequence is over. Tonight in Taiwan, 40,000 households are without water. Now overnight, there have been many more aftershocks, which is why the authorities are telling the people to stay out of the buildings in case there is structural damage. David. All right, Bob, we appreciate it. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.